jazz guy. Let me see what it starts from back in here. One of these is going to work perfectly fine. and then it makes it easy. part in and of itself and that's just a clip of the whole bass line that goes into do 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 so shit where were we with that let's see so i'm gonna go ahead and copy one of these whole regions so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna press copy then i'm gonna go way down here someplace and i'm just gonna like start doing the whole thing oh shit no, I want to paste it. Sorry. So, Command V. And then I'm going to come back here later and I'm going to grab this whole region. And I'm just going to insert these in any place I want. It's like remixing like Uncle and all those guys. Or any of these fucking guys. Like Rez or whatever. But yeah, it could be. It could. It totally has a burst sound. But we're, we haven't even put any kind of melodic thing in there. It's just like, there's some rhythmic thing still. But it's going to get crazy really quick. So I'm just going to copy this now and just make this infinity long. So I got another 10 minutes of that whole section. 
And what I'm going to do is whenever I want, I'm going to grab whole regions so we can just compose. It's going to A, B, C, D, like, like picture a train, you know, and you're like, oh, you got so many of these things, you know, like you make it all balanced. Oh. So let's see if it lets me go back in, into here. Okay. You know, it's almost like I could totally see these guys with this technology. Like, before I've even finished a beat, they've already put it and filmed the whole commercial, and they're showing it back to me. They're like, thanks. Unbelievable, these times. Like, the voice recognitions, you know, it's just like, it's so funny, huh? Just picked up that we were doing that kind of music. How in the hell did they just pick up that it was like some urban fucking thing when they, you know what I mean, with that beat and everything? That was that was like a commercial that came on on, on the dead TV. It was just like for some fucking like new Honda car or whatever. So, anyways, let, let's get back to the um, creating here, okay? Sorry, I got I'm I'm already smoking a new cigarette because that just bummed me out that much. So, what I need to do now is find a whole loop in here again. And I didn't think like it mattered at the beginning, so let me see. I can select any region, area. I'm just gonna find like the whole run. Some friendly fucking shit. Somebody, email fucking Depeche Mode. Tell them I got a new idea for him. We're gonna save their fat asses, right? Put them right back in the mix. Funny. Yeah, this kid, this 44 year old kid, kid with this crazy thing. I'm using Pro Tools. Okay, you're right. God, we can do such weird shit just with this riff. Another good region. We gotta save this one too. I guess it doesn't matter because I can rip these from anywhere. So we're gonna get really freaky here in a minute. It's gonna be so good. It'll be like fucking some crazy. Isn't that crazy? Happy Halloween! <laughs> Genre? You don't even know. Like, what are, what are you talking? Some kind of smack, Ula? What kind of genre? Anyways, let's get back to working. Let's not worry about people. Okay, I gotta select a region, so I'm gonna find out where this rip begins.
So I'm just going to select one of these root bass <laughs> make it double for variation so now we got a basic starting you know let's we'll start with the drum drum beat yeah um this is gonna be some mystical shit in a minute i, I think we'll see because you haven't even seen me play guitar in a while i can fuck that shit up so it, let's see what this sounds like again ready this, now this is my bass loop select this whole region and I'm slap it up to the beginning and I'm gonna just fucking copy like eight minutes and 20 seconds of this so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna remove the first baseline I think just for a second so I'm gonna switch it off all we're gonna go right down the line and we're gonna start repa replacing regions make it really weird okay no, it's not easy because like once you like start doing millions of things, like it gets really, really weird. If it was easy, you know, like fucking people with so much talent would just be blowing doors like around the clock. Not everybody, you know, that it, your your brain starts playing tricks on you when you when you get like super smart. You start, to, you know, like you could just sit there for fucking hours, like going. Ugh. That's why I like kick back and, and play songs and shit and just sit there, you know. I uh, like and play around with you guys when my brain's thinking about you know like see because this re record that I'm working on it's like um you know like I came up with all these songs that sound like they just could be the, our band playing and I yeah my beard's white but it has been for like years um anyway I don't dye my hair see it's just that's it's genetics if, if my beard's uh, bothering you, you know, I could just point this at the screen or something and not go on. But anyway, what I was going to say is I did all these like um, 60s type, whatever, not 60s, but like our band playing that our weird style, you know, like Stairway to the Best Party of the Universe or whatever that style. And then I also make this stuff that I, I, you know, with these crazy beats or whatever they make up and stuff. And I can't see myself really playing live like that. Even though it'd be easy, I would just do exactly what all my friends do and play the, the fucking Pro Tools mix, like every single band you can imagine, it's like My Believe Valentine or anybody. But I don't know if that I want to do that, or if I do that, I want to do that like a, um, you know, if I did that, it would be like play some weird fucking festival here, play, go on tour with, bring some weird people and just play with this crazy army of orchestration and do weird, crazy shit. But in the meantime, like I don't, I don't want that to um, bug the way I write. Like I can write like all these different styles at once, so I can sit down and play like a folk song, you know. And and it, 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 there's nothing to me, like you know, look to it, like see, you know, like I can play like that Bobby Jameson cover and just 
fully feel that and not resist the temptation to like not make music like that turn into something else. So, anyways, let's let's deal with this. In Berlin, what I want to do, what I want to do in Europe is I want to um, sort of what I'd like to see happen is uh, you know that I make up a bunch of music with some people with foreign languages and stuff. You know, I like to make some crazy shit. So, anyways, let's keep going. Um, God, that's a dumb question. Uh, I'm making up a song right now. I'm not playing anything. See, I'm making all this up from scratch right now. So, yeah, exactly. So, anyways, I'm going to delete this first thing, start the beat. Just do this right here. Get rid of the first two two tracks now, because I can always back these up. See, so when you when you, I'm not using a grid or any kind of thing like that. It's all my own timing. But when I'm using these regions of the drum loop that I made and, and quarter regions of those or whatever, I can just erase some of them. And if I ever want to put it back there or change it around, I can just move the whole song along because it's all regions. So it just works out. So I'm gonna go ahead and erase these two now. The the first two measures and let's see what this sounds like with just the drum coming in. See, now we need to like get weird with this, this, that other shit. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I can bring any of the, the, the mixing up or down. I was just moving some things around to see what they sound like. Um, so now what I want to do, so I'm going to erase this loop, looks like. And we got to find, what do I got to be? It's slip, shuffle, shuffle mode maybe. Let's see if I can, um. Go down here now and find one of these other loops that I just thought was crazy. I guess I can grab one from anywhere. So let me see one of these parts. Back into slip mode. want this one I think. Okay, so I'm gonna grab it from right here. Now in theory I could just put this in I'm gonna nudge this up together now, as close as I can get it. Looks like maybe I have to do what? Shuffle, spot, grid. I can't remember which one I have to do. Oh, uh, it's that one. Ha <laughs> ha! Shuffle. Okay, from slip to shuffle. 
Let me see. That's brilliant. That makes it so much easier, man. Okay. So in theory, now it's going to go from this to this. flying the wall again. second um so i'm gonna keep it that simple now i don't know what this is gonna do yet here we go to this again because I might want to do something different in fact so shuffle maybe if I take one of these out now I'm just gonna try to experiment here so all Let's see what this does if I just take one of these circuits out okay now it's an uneven number. Next thing, flip mode. I'm going to want to come down here someplace. What is this? The, the last bit of it? So let's see. Sorry, I'm just trying to do some science here. That's on all. That's why. Trying to figure out. Okay. So I 
I'm going to take one of these from down here. They go do do. So let's see. Now I'm just going to fly this fucker in here. Let's see where it, where it goes. Okay, it's starting at the beginning again. For now. It's going to be harpsichord instead, I think. So anyways, I'm going to undo that. Let me count these regions again and think about vocals for a minute. Because then we're going to add a melody. <laughs> Take one of these. Oh, mistake. There we go. Fixed. Haha. <laughs> I understand how to do this a little bit better now. Okay. Delete that. Shuffle mode just. Okay, I understand. 
I'm gonna get quick with this in a minute. So, so now, commercial, unbelievable. I killed it this time. Um, here I go. Not to lose track. So, uh, one, so one, two, three, four, five. Shuffle and put. Okay. Um, so then I'm going to want this to go away out of shuffle. Let's see. Um, okay. What am I doing? All right. Delete. So delete, 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 delete. Okay. Then it's 228, man. Then I can just ride this shit out, maybe. So do two more of those. Okay, I see how this is going now. Command D. Command D. Okay, I know what it'll do. So, then I'm going to go delete, 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 delete. Okay. Now we have basically a song, maybe. I'll delete this too. Okay, let's see how this goes now. Okay, now we're ready to record more tracks because it's basically going to be a three minute long song and I made it so it breaks down, no drums, so it'll just be the bass for a second and slam back into it. Yeah, I'm doing remixes as we go along, but instead of sampling, I'm, I'm making my own source material. like. People do that have some kind of ideas rather than going, Oh, this would be cool. Just take all these other people's ideas. So let's see.
that drum break right there. That's my only problem with that. Um, I messed up with my map. So I have to come in here and grab this. Stretch this back out for a second. Um, grab these ones where I pulled a break. It's looking like. And I'm going to go ahead and duplicate that so that's back to normal. So way too long that's what happened so I'm gonna have to go in here grab one of these press copy and put this over this maybe let me see um, oh yeah sorry you guys here we go so the command B so now it would do this and then skip out right here maybe so let me see if I can do this right. So one, oops, I don't want it like that. So, so it plays this, and then breaks down right here. Breaks down right here. Okay, sorry guys. So, right here. what happens like this. So this isn't a vocal part, this no whole section has to go. Now we can see what happens. Okay, let me see. Sorry about that. That's what confused me. Let's see what happens. <laughs> drums out does it need to be two times out do you think are you guys listening in the chat room like when it drops the drums just a quick two maybe should I try like that with just quick two out two whole measure somehow and then come back in this is towards the end of the song we want to move on anyways I'll just try it who cares what you guys think about that um, Maybe I'll just try. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. I'll get trickier somehow. Um, I'll just pull these out. Okay, let's see if this. Going back to this breakdown on this drum. <laughs> Make 
added some more tracks now. Somehow this one down here is just something like crazy all of a sudden. What's up with this? <laughs> Anyways, let's let's start recording again. <clears throat> now we got this weird thing going. So I'm going back to the mini mood or the core. Turn this down a little bit and just start recording. Whoops. Okay, yeah. Put some bells in there for you, <laughs> Joe Kyle. Let me see. Uh, I'm 
just need some weird sound. Let's see. I can just mix them in whenever I want now. So we're just going to keep building loops now. And we'll just mix them in like crazy. Ch -ch -ch edit it all fucking. <clears throat> so. make some weird pattern like how they go on and off for a minute so we got to make some geometry out of this so it's starting at the beginning I don't think we should have it in the beginning I'll just make a fade in so command F going to delete the first one of these because I don't even like this thing in the beginning so I'm going to fade this in later hopefully let me see if I can just do it like from here let's see what that sounds like command F we're just experimenting for a minute
see how that works for a minute. Let's tune in. of delay just
Here we go. Let's see what it sounds like. Because that was just one. By the end, it's going to be crazy feeding back like that. delay on the bass on accident. Sorry guys, gotta start again. That was weird. Here we go. Space Cadet. Sorry about it. Here we go. Sorry if I'm boring you guys, but we're not done yet. Here we go.
We're going to do ascending, descending scales.
slam some guitar in there. First, we're just gonna detune this one. This one with this box, I think. I'm gonna tune it up right to the song. To that riff and then I'll figure out a, a slide bar chord to make it go heavy. So let's see what this sounds like overnight. <laughs>
leaving us for now. Um, another track, man. Here we go. I don't even have to think about this one because I can hear it in my head. <laughs>
it sounds wicked. It's a frequency thing. So, then that has to be everywhere. And I have to take it in and out. So let's see. Starting at the beginning again. <laughs>
save. I should name this instead of a date, because if you see, I've got a... <laughs> I'm going to call this the... Okay, this song's called The Bestest Aquarium Day Plan. <laughs> I probably will in a... <sighs> um, bestest. <laughs> the bestest of aquarium day plan. Um, I don't know if I feel like singing in front of all you people. Make it slip enough. But I can make a mad fucking weird weird shit to this. It's 2.35 already. It's like this and like that, you know. It's probably time for me to bike home. I think I've done enough work. But, <clears throat> so that, so like, when I'm at an, another studio, like when I, when I go to Iceland and live for a couple months or something, you know, and I'm making a record, It's like 500 euros a day for the studio, sometimes a thousand or something. So you can fuck around like, if you're going to do that to make records, then you can just like try different things, you know, you could get a house another time instead, like rent a house and, and set up a studio or something, or auto mechanic shop, it's what we did, we built this like... We just built all this inside of like, if you went to inside, inside of like an auto garage, we just built the upstairs and the downstairs. Yeah, well, the, the concept is, is like, if you, if you pick a good place, you couldn't do this in Brooklyn. But, you know, <clears throat> if you're really making records that people really buy, then it's like every day in the studio, not counting engineers, you know, it's like over a thousand a day, thousand, thousand US or a thousand euros or whatever. You know, most people spend forty five thousand. I mean, they spend forty five days to make and mix a record, like a, a, a big label band, somebody that's got a bunch of records out. You know, so you figure like, if the Black Angels got some deal, you know, like one of the fake indies that they have now. Like, there's all these indies that pretend to be independent labels, but they're not. They're 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 just major labels. Major labels shut down to these little smaller compartments that didn't have the uh, overheads, and just they just name them and they kind of pretend like they're doing indie right, but it's not. But anyways, so it's like they get like fifty thousand, you know, to make a record. So they they record for like two and a half weeks or something, and then mix for the rest, you know. And then the engineer takes like. 30 or 40 the producer or something well every one of those thousands pays the rent on a space like this for a month so every day that I spend when I'm in another studio I can spend a month here just making loops for the same price and then you just like um, you bring in you know, I just make a phone call and this band pulls up and I come in here one day and there'll be like 20 channels of me, big desk, and all kinds of shit, you know, out in the other room. Just be all of a sudden to be a massive recording studio and then I, you know, and I'll use that for like two weeks and then that stuff will go away. Or we'll just like order some shit and then we'll have that here. So like this room always changes around, like it'll be totally different gear do it but anyway so the idea was to I wanted to start like making movie soundtracks but people are such dipshits they don't understand like you know you get on a soundtrack and that's like a marketing thing everything is just one big machine like they got fucking cokes 
they're driving a Beamer, it's all a giant commercial, and then the music that's playing in the background, it's a commercial for the music, and the music's a commercial for the movie. But it's not like, even they go like, we want you to, Anton, we want you to do a song for Twilight. It's called Twilight Vampire Mistake, or something. You know, then these guys just fucking will throw in some words like, and it's my Twilight Vampire Mistake to their dumbass fucking thing. You know, and and they'll call it, oh, Twinkly Vampire Twilight Mistake, you know? And every single band, every single movie, that's what you see. So, <laughs> yeah. So, so, but I want to actually see, like, in this thing, I've got, like, I do, like, three of these every day, something like this. Just weird things. So, every single day. So what I want to do is like make some fucking mad movie music, like, like crazy, you know. And so instead of it being like, oh well, this is a song I want in my movie, you know, you just want to use it like everybody else does. I want to do something rad with with some filmmakers in Europe and just make it like fucking crazy, crazy music to where like if you're watching this movie and all of a sudden it switches into something like you know like all of a sudden I don't know, you know. It could be anything, but, you know, it, 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 we could be playing something crazy, like... Let me grab one more chord.
heard that sound. but I just recorded. Some weird shit. Let's see. Command F. Trade that fucker in. See how this works now. part as soon as the things go in I'm gonna make this just pop in and out every other track so let me just start it it's gonna be fucking good so so let me figure out where it Grab one of these clicks and make even a tighter little thing of just two times, looks like, of just um, two clicks, and then I'll be able to count. I know it doesn't make any sense, but let me think. Um, if I just. How long do I want it? Let's see. If I cut one of these in half, if I can do this. Um, I'm 
that shit didn't even sync up. Oh, that was no wonder. It was a microscopic mistake in there. Brilliant on the click track. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, so I don't need this track anymore. Whatever I just did. Um, sorry. Fuck, I wanted to edit this thing all wacky. Let me see if I can do it. Okay. Um, so it's playing. <laughs> Do that. This seems kind of random. Let's just track B, F, B. Okay, let me see. If I chop this fucking thing right here. And then I can. This is gonna sound rad, just give me one second. Okay, so now I want to do every other one of these, so. Uh, and then. This might just do it. Let's see. Sorry, one more time.
that's enough, children. Quit Pro Tools. Save Pro Tools.